Good to be first if you're looking at the Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. You probably didn't expect to see that before the intro. In the last episode, we ended up going to the Tide Song Hotel. We met Cena and Dexio, and then we ended up making it here to Paniola Town and beat Hal. So, we're going to start off. I'm going to show you real quick our new uh, team members, Cinnamon, the... Uh, the Shiny bay leaf. So cinnamon, I told you that I bred. If you saw, there was a, I did a video a while back when I hatched my shiny chikorita. Ended up being female. I had Jad dupe it. I have a level 45 one, I think, in the PC right now. I basically brought everything from uh, uh, from Moon and then put it in this game. So hope the main reason, because I was thinking about, because we found the Mew, the dude who wanted us to I show him a Mew so we can get medium Z from him and then uh, the, the Pikachu that wanted a cat Pikachu to meet once anyways we have cinnamon here with tackle poison powder leech seed and razor leaf now shiny bay leaf is not as good as shiny chikorita and I spent all this time making a like changing up the hues to make the chikorita look shiny on the for the card art for the sidebar and I ended up evolving it because I've got to evolve level 16 so anyways uh, yeah so I decided to bench Samba for now because Samba's just not that great I don't know when it learns anything new uh, so, I may end up dropping cinnamon so we can use this thing, but in all honesty, I'm plenty fine with using cinnamon. So, I want to see if I have that cat Pikachu, because all of these, I have a bunch of league mons and whatnot. Okay, so I apparently left the Pikachu in Moon or something. I'm going to figure that out. Maybe, I was going to say, I think, <sighs> that's actually really weird. I need to figure out what the heck is up with that. Actually, I'm going to do that right now because I'm I'm a bit confused as to where it is. They didn't redo the music. I just didn't remember this being the music Paniola Town. It's just like gone. The only Pikachu in either my box or my... My Pokebank are... It's, this is so weird. That literally makes no sense. My cat Pikachu is just gone. So th they say you can only get one, and I had the Sinnoh cat Pikachu, but I don't know what happened to my Pikachu, because I definitely got it. It was the series of hardy nature, whatever it was. Mine had perfect special attack, I think HP and speed. It was definitely, special attack and speed were perfect. What the hell happened to it? Dude, that is frustrating. That was one of the only reasons I actually did all this shit. That's so st that's so weird, dude. I don't get that. Literally, it's just gone. My cap, my Sinnoh cap Pikachu is just gone. I never traded it. I had it in my game. I don't have Pikachu registered to my Pokedex in this game. So it's literally just gone. These are all a bunch of Pokemon that I brought over. That's about it. Yeah, the Volcania. <laughs> but I have all these Mews so I can get my Medium Z. But, bro, that straight up makes no sense. That is so frustrating. I wonder if there's any other way you can get up a Cat Pikachu. Because you only get one, obviously. And since they're probably not doing anything more for these games. Sup, dude? You gotta be a trial guard. I gotta get sense of time and Captain's here. I don't really care if Mallow's here or not. But I don't get a choice. I still love this. The mill tank is just so adorable running over. I really wish there was a way to skip cutscenes for real. Like, you could press start and skip the cutscene. I found the fresh water. There's another... Look at that. There's another sticker over here. Alright, we'll do the whole Tauros event. And just fight the Tauros, because why not? All right, cinnamon sparkle. But I have to admit that shiny bay leaf looks more like a cinnamon than Chikorita does. Even though I love the name for Chikorita. Them stall tactics. That worked out pretty well. Good job, cinnamon. Proud of you. Level 17. Yeah, I'm gonna kind of have to keep you in- Oh my gosh. <laughs> I shouldn't have used Poker on Refresh on it. Now we got a scope lens. Very nice. Oh, that's a trainer. I forgot to- 
I think I forgot to take uh, bay leaf out of the front. So Cinnamon's gonna get more XP. But I think you do have a Mudbray, yeah. You did in the first game. Wow. Finnaman, you're pretty good. But we'll take this thing out with a gust. I forget what Mudbray's other ability is, besides Stamina. Because Stamina is such a good ability, but this... You're learning Reflect now. But, obviously, there's been several Mudbrays that i fought that actually have not had that move. Dang it, ran into Pokemon. I was actually trying to avoid that. Hey, it's a Paralyzed Heal. Last Grass. That's fun. So I wonder if the stickers are in place of Zygarde cells? Because I know that there's a Zygarde to sell right here this sticker coming up is. And I know for sure that I never actually got that cell in the Moon Wonder Wedlock. And I just never ended up getting it. That's interesting that you can find Mareep here. Alright, we're gonna try to catch this Mareep here. Yay. Boring gold. We'll see if I use them. But I caught it just because if I want to, I have it. Sweet. I made it out without anything more. So heal me up, Miltank. You want to use this? All right. We get hidden power. Sweet. Cinnamon can learn hidden power, and her hidden power is water. And it has a better special attack anyway, so I'm going to give uh, Cinnamon that hidden power water. Because, <laughs> like, why not, right? Can you learn Brick Break now? You can't. I was really hoping that um, our little flippin' Java here could learn it. But let's see. What do you want? He was spoken that potential... Okay, so you're... Alright, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna... Whatever. We've got nurseries, but whatever. I'll take the egg. I think it's a... I think it's an EB. And I'm gonna put the Mareep in the PC, obviously. Well, not obviously, but I'm gonna do it. What? What's his name? Here's him to him to cure hatch. What? That is actually like something that's really dope. All right, we're gonna do that typical thing where you r run around inside this. I knew I got I I have plenty of experience with that. I I hatched a lot of eggs. All right, we're gonna bring in Mr. Satan. And you might get not get the reference. It just kind of made sense. I don't know. Talonflame being a firebird, and Satan typically being, well, predicted as like the leader of hell. But it's, it's actually named after the Dragon Ball character. <laughs> that was actually way quicker than I expected it to be. That flame body really works wonders. It it, it was an Eevee, so I mean I expected it. But I don't think I really want it. <laughs> Wait, what two am I missing? Vaporeon and Jolteon. <laughs> the rest of them, I forgot about that. I competitively trained all of them except for the Leafeon. The Leafeon was the one we used in the playthrough. And the one, Y1, X Wonder Wedlock, what are you? Oh, you're female. I don't even know what to call you then. We'll give you no name for now because I don't know if I'm even going to use it. I'm not going to use it most likely because... That's a bit boring. But if we can get a water stone, <clears throat> and it ends up being decent enough, it's got a, yeah, it's got a naughty nature, so it's definitely not that great to be a Vaporeon, but if you want me to use it as Vaporeon or a Jolteon, let me know, and I will do so if we can get those stones easy enough. All right, we got a couple of trainers to face, and we can also get this item here. It's the amulet coin. That's actually really nice. I'm going to give that to N, even though I... Took off his items so he didn't have one, but we're going to give him the amulet coin because we can get a little bit of extra case money while we're doing things. That'd be really cool. Anyway, uh, let's talk. Running a Pokemon is even fixing my truck. Probably. Michael leads out with Lillipup. Lillipup, Lillipup, my Lillipup, go! Alright, good job, Ben. Took out the Lillipup. Very good. Magnemite. Alright, I'll stay in. I was thinking about going into our Noibat, but it's actually going to be a little better to use this guy here. 
Provided N doesn't get paralyzed, of course it does. I shouldn't have said anything. <sighs> and of course you go through a thunder shock. Anyway, it doesn't matter. It'll the brick break would have taken it no matter what. No matter what. So they're both actually gonna get up to level uh, 18. So that's pretty neat. Natalie wants to learn agility. No. And grew to level 18. What's he gonna learn? Nothing. Okay. What have won if I didn't lose? Yes, that's kind of how that works. But I can quote black and white. It's not about win or lose. It's the road you choose. And the answer within. It's not about win or lose. It's the road you choose. And the answer's within. Not always black and white. But your heart always knows what's right. He said, let me have a look at my kid. What, you keep your kid in a Pokeball? That's inhumane. I need to actually find one of those Sableye. Actually catch one. I need to go to 10 Carat Hill. I never did. Forgot about that. <sighs> I hate the people that use the full restores. Imagine actually battling someone who, who healed like you could. We'll just spam potions over and over again. Just think about how much that would suck to fight. Yeesh. Anyway, goodbye, save life. 401 XP. Holy crap. What's up, dude? Find Brooklyn Hill at the end of Route 5. Oh, they're about. <laughs> Want to try guys here to help? Uh, feel like learning a mysterious move? See if you can beat all. Change it on. So it's secret power. Or nature power. Which one is the one that uses the berries? I think that might be nature power. Cottony and Petalo. Alright. Oh, and you're gonna paralyze my Noi Bat. Ah, uh, you and your prankster. But anyway, we're gonna hit that Petalo pretty hard. That did a lot of damage, actually. Even with the paralysis, Natalie still at speeds. Or maybe the speed stat doesn't change until after the turn. Ah, that's awesome, actually. The illusion actually makes uh, cinnamon... Makes N uh, immune to the leech seed. That time it wasn't immune to the leech seed. Probably won't matter though. Yep. Sweet. Good job, guys. Proud of y'all. Cinnamon grew to level 19. N, excuse me. Where did he gain so much XP from? I didn't realize he was that close. <laughs> I'm too young for math. Ooh, super potion. Sweet. Can I believe this is. I don't remember if this is taunt or torment. Wait, but you can't get up here? What? Oh, it's up here. Okay. Maybe that's just like a placebo to make you, like, double take or something. It is torment. Okay. I can remember. We get, um, it's not too long until we get Brutal Swing. What are y'all doing here? I forget. Dude, squats to really use all your muscles. My leg's like shaking so hard I can't move. I'm not doing a little insane, I'm not. I'm definitely trying not to be like Kunala. So I can't fight you? Man, I really hate that, that they just, like, turn, fade your screen black and then put you out of the, the area. It's just like, come on, man. You don't need to do that. If I can't get past them, I literally cannot walk past them. It's immoral, and I don't know why I left N in front. N doesn't remember the first time I met you. Aww. I was so surprised that you could actually find Wild Zora. And I, and I caught you because Zora was dope. Let's see, will the moral go down? It will. And effects for you're gonna put him to... S Poor Natalie. Natalie just gets messed up over and over again, dude. Next up is a Lediva. I'll stay in, I think. Well, should have gone for wing attack. I suppose it probably won't matter that much. Yeah, Natalie's just gonna stay asleep. Oh my gosh, get destroyed, Lediva. I didn't think that would one-shot. I know not Natalie's good and all, but I didn't think that one show. That's absurd. Oh. I forgot about Gladian. <laughs> Man, I lost again. Are you even taking this seriously? I am so serious. I'm seriously enjoying it. Enjoying it? You can enjoy Pokemon Battle and you put everything you have into it. But clearly you haven't. Whoa, hey, Olivia. Olivia, this guy's plenty scary. You're Olivia? Uh, who? <laughs> He's in a sense to be wary, not bad. 
I'm glad I am. Me and my partner took me training to get stronger. I have to get stronger. The most of the time these days go worse. Mark for Tim Skull and Muscle. As a muscle or something. Battle me. I won't take Nova and answer. Infinite power! <laughs> Alright, I forget who I'm leaning out with. I think it's Natalie. Okay, good. That'll work. Natalie's kind of slow. That's why I did so much damage. I was about to say, wait, because I, <laughs> I didn't think a Zubat using Faint Attack, you know, would do that much damage. That's crazy. That makes sense, though. It's a Zora. Hang there, Natalie. Don't die. Damn it. I shouldn't... I'm going to save the Z double kick for uh, Type Null. Because Type Null will probably be a little bit difficult to take care of. Anyway, good job, Java. Proud of you. Natalie grew level 19. Oh, yeah. Next up is the, is the actual Zubat. Okay. We'll switch. Um, Judy! You can handle this. Plus two pound just does so much damage. Let's go. And Judy took down the Zubat. It's actually like really fun to just set up with Judy. Alright, let's see what Judy can do. I'm going to heal her up and see how much damage she takes from the Titan Ult. Because I will, obviously, I will use my Z, uh, I'll use my Z double kick if I have to. Alright. That's decent. Let's see how much a, a plus two pound will do. That's not much. Alright. Well, we're gonna swap and we're gonna let Java use the Z double kick. Alright, here goes that Z double kick. I really need to change up my outfit. It's so bad. <laughs> Wow, you know what? I kind of expect that to, to kill. How much will your tackle do? <clears throat> Let's see if a double kick will knock him out. Yep. So we good job, guys. Java grew to level 19. That's my girl. Wants to learn roar. No. No, I don't want to learn roar. Judy gain a bunch of XP too. How annoying! $680 for winning. Thanks. Huh. It's not like me to slip up like that. I gotta keep fighting strong opponents. Looks like I'm still not ready. Strong opponents? That kid there, his Pokemon are weak. I'm sure it's fun to enjoy battling this brat. He's just using an excuse to try out because he can't beat the Kahuna. Because he can't be hollow when he's serious. You what? You know my gramps? Wait, you think I'm strong? Oh, look at you little daddy, and I think you're just a real cool guy. <laughs> Guess no spine's a homeless kid to turn out spineless too, huh? No one's got enough backbone to cover for you. Just give it up already. Huh? You know you can't beat me. You'll just get your Pokemon hurt for no reason. They're good Pokemon. Keep on swimming for what would a big fat waste of time thanks to you. If you hadn't gotten away, we could have stolen the totem Pokemon from Brooklyn Hill. Let's get out of here. Look, the Murkrow are crying. It's time we should be flying. Listen up, guy. And the boss is like you. That's true. There's some higher top we keep her around when you need. Your arm part is going. Oh, not really. Never will. We got it. You better get it. Gliding would literally kick your ass. I'm. Let's be honest. They're nothing. It's <laughs> just stupid grunts. Okay, anyway. Thanks, Lily. You know I bet, too. You both give it your all. <laughs> Looks like a train on my stream. We're gonna take on blood ever. Anyway, thanks for the revives, dude. Peace. There's a couple of trainers over here. Let's pick up these berries. He's just, I like how they're literally just frozen. Yeah, glad he's kind of scary. You think? Look much stronger than normal Team Skull Grunts, that's for sure. Let's fight, dude. Battles are best for raising Pokemon. So I was just looking at this over here on level 19. Uh, Petalil learns uh, Magical Leaf. So I may end up adding it to the squad. 
over. So I love cinnamon. I just don't really know if I want to use it because it's actually it gains XP way too quickly. It's a good Pokemon and all, but you know, I've never actually like really used a pet a little at all. So you know, but a little. All right, and Natalie took down the Spinarak. This entire trainer actually with like four gusts. Good job, Natalie. Even in Pokemon Loose, it's okay as long as their trainer goes from that. Now, if I could have... Oh, I can avoid the double battle. Sweet! That's perfect. Because I want to... Uh... I want to get Petalo. My bag's telling me I have a new TM. Oh, yeah, Torment. I was thinking, wait, did I get a TM that I forgot about? Lilypup for Noibat. Okay, I have a... I have a Noibat. Sure. Uh... Corsola, I'm terrible fishing. If I, uh... Try to catch Corsola. Alright, let's fight, dudes. Combos that can't be used alone can be used when there's two. Alright, I've got Torcat and Petalo up front. So see what happens. I don't remember what these guys have. It may have changed, too. Vullaby and Rufflet, yeah, that makes sense. Some, but I'm not sure if I want to leave her out here. That's the issue. Alright, I'm gonna Fire Fang the Vullaby. Because I feel like the Vullaby will be more of an issue. And I definitely don't want... Samba to go down, I want Samba to get all this XP. And having Java or Judy out here too will be really nice. Because then I can... The, they, okay, good. They didn't both go for... Uh, yeah. Well, I did over half of the Ruffalo. That's nice. Nasty plot. I don't even have a special move at this point. Alright, and there goes the Ruffalo. Sweet. Yeah. <laughs> it went for an nasty plot and then for another pluck. It's like, come on, man. You can do better. Anyway. Um, the combination will take it out. So there we go. Sweet. Good job, guys. Judy grew to level 20. Judy, that'd be I'd be, like, so happy if you evolved right now. Jala grew to level 20. Nice. Some of them might get to level 19. Nope. Oh my gosh, cameras are so difficult, but that's why they're fun. Yes! <laughs> Let's go! Perfect. I knew it as soon as there was silence, I'm like... <gasps> Look at you, Judy. You're all grown up. Look at Judy. Holy crap, I just looked at, like, Megalopony stats compared to normal Lopony's, and wow, Megalopony Lopony out, just completely outclasses normal Lopony. It's crazy. It's gonna learn Return now. Oh, that's nice. It's got some really cool level up moves, like, it, it learns Bounce, like, by, you have to relearn it, but it learns Bounce. It learns Jump Kick it. Oh. It learns Jump Kick at 23. Man, this thing's gonna be good. I'm so excited that we finally have one. So what it'll be wearing is it's like a fighting. At the same time, it can deliver power ki powerful kicks with its legs. And we're gonna get rid of Pound, because Quick Attack is the same power, but has the benefit of priority. Well, Pound is just Pound. I'm, a I'm actually really excited. I'm really excited. It's cool to have you evolve, Judy. You beautiful little bunny. It's awesome. Congrats on your Pokemon evolving. You know what this occasion calls for? Some awesome photos with a newly evolved Pokemon. Good idea. Let's give Judy some time in the spotlight. Judy seems content. I'm glad you're content. That was awesome. That's just, I'm gonna start up the Roto Lotto. Okay, I actually did get a Roto Lotto. At the end of the last episode, uh, you guys didn't see it. It was the prize money boost. Two roto catches. What does that mean? Makes it easy to catch wild Pokemon you use in battle. That's actually really good. That'll be something good for legendaries. Or if, like, you want to catch a Pokemon with a beast ball to, uh... Just if, if you breed it. 
I'm so happy we got a Lopini. That's awesome. Can you have the fantasy find the Pokemon? Man, I was actually hoping you were a trainer. Now, oh yeah, can I battle the, the grunts now? That I that I did the whole uh, Gladian event? Oh, they're just gone entirely. Okay. Man, is there nothing else to... No trainer, no more trainers to actually fight? Alright, Samba grew to level 19. It's going to learn magically. Good. Alright, so let's get rid of... Oh, I actually like it's got a decent move set. I'm gonna get rid of leech seed. It was like hell to get out of that grass. <laughs> Jeez um. Anyways, I think that's where I'm gonna be ending this episode. Really been enjoyed it, especially in the next episode we'll be going to uh whatever you call it. We'll take on Lana's trial. And uh yeah, we now have a Lopany, which is pretty dope. I need to figure out when Zoro evolves. Uh, I know a lot of Pokemon in 5th Gen ended up evol ev evolving super late. So we'll see what happens with that. But anyways, thanks so much for watching. You've been Drew. Do you like this picture? I'll talk to you all later.